I need to find out who killed him, detective. Right now. What's going on guys and welcome to another Reputized video. Dark Crime starring Jim Carrey and was directed by Alexandros Avranez. It's all about this detective who comes to be suspicious of this author when incidences described in this author's novel resemble an unsolved murder cold case. Now, I was a big fan of Ace Ventura, Dumb and Dumber, and The Mask, but he hadn't come out with a good hit since the early 2000s which I think was the number 23. After that, nothing, until he popped back up in number number two. And now he comes out with this, Dark Crimes. It's kind of hard to, you know, really review a movie like this because when you do a review, you want to say nothing but good things about it, about whatever you're reviewing. But Unfortunately, this is not going to be one of those videos, guys. The feel of it was really bad. It, it was really boring, and I think a lot of that has to do, do with the dialogue. That, that, that's exactly what this movie was. A lot of the dialogue in it was just nothing. <laughs> like, you know, the character build-up... I, I really didn't give a crap about any of them. Jim Carrey, he tried, but most of it was just really bland. It left a bad taste in my mouth. And it's all over this murder case, over this one asshole, I gotta say. You know, the way everybody's describing this guy that Jim Carrey's character is trying to get justice for was like a sadist. And he's trying to figure out who murdered him. I admit, murder's never right. Murdering somebody is never right, no matter who it is. But in this case, you know, I just didn't give a crap at all. The music by Richard Patrick and Tobias Ennis, I think I'm pronouncing that guy's name right, was, you know, for what it was, it was very slow. And it was trying, I, I see what they were trying to do. It was trying to capture the, the type of movie this was. But it, in the end, it just... Everything about this movie was just very bland. It was a compelling story if it was written a little better. You know, if it was given a little bit of a higher budget. I don't think this is one of those movies that hit theaters. I, I think it's one of those that just hit straight to Blu-ray and DVD and that was it. You know, most of the scenes just was boring and it just didn't really rope me in. I gotta give props to the lighting. It was very dark. It being a murder mystery movie... I could definitely understand that, but it wasn't so dark to where you couldn't see. It was one of those forgettable movies, not really worth your time. I'm going to give Dark Crimes an F. First one I've ever gave, folks. It is what it is, but that's my opinion. What did you think of Dark Crimes, or have you heard of it, or are you interested in it? Let me know down in the comments below. Like, subscribe, get reputized, watch out for more reviews coming soon. Peace to Rampage.